In four years, the planetarium at Roper Mountain Science Center has been drawing big crowds. The recent renovations and upgrades have it selling out every week. It's so busy, the center is adding new shows, making sure everyone can check it out. Rochelle Spence joins us live in Greenville this morning to tell us all about it. She's going to appear right there, or actually right there. <laughs> Hey, Fred, Tracy, good morning. Absolutely. So I've got the planetarium to myself right now. We all know how fun this is, but it's also educational, which brings out a lot of students, parents, and just a ton of people from the community here in the upstate. And for that reason, people who work here have had to put up the sold out sign pretty much every single Friday for these shows. And because of that, they're adding new ones, new times. It's a good problem to have. Joining me now is Thomas Verrilli, the assistant director here at Roper Mountain Science Fair. This is maybe the coolest morning live shot I've done this far. Well, I, I appreciate you being here. Thanks for having <laughs> us. And yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. Wow. Even adults, you can really enjoy this. So my photographer, Christy, she's showing the ceiling right now. You can see Earth up above our heads. Tell me a little bit about the new shows that you're adding. I, I see a couple Elmo references throughout the planetarium. Oh, yeah. So um, our newest uh, show that we're just kicking off tomorrow night is One World, One Sky, and it features Elmo and Big Bird. It's going to be extremely popular. Um, we've demoed it or showed it, previewed it to our staff already, and everyone just fell in love with it. But it's going to be uh, a, a great show. All right, and then we're also expecting a total solar eclipse this summer. Tell me what you've got kind of previewing that and, and educating kids, right? Yeah, well, absolutely. So um, the solar eclipse, of course, is August 21st uh, of this, this summer, and our 845 show is called Solar Eclipse, and it's one that we'll all be also be showing during the Eclipse Festival um, that weekend. But you can come out and learn how to safely view the eclipse, um, what historically eclipses have been like, how they've been received around the world, and the science behind uh, solar eclipse. Exactly what is a solar eclipse so yeah it's, it's a fantastic show as well awesome well thank you so much waking up super early with us this morning on daybreak if you want to come out adults at six dollars a ticket and then for kids five we are live in greenville i'm going to kick back and relax in this planetarium rochelle spence seven news how did she get this duty nice i guess we gotta should probably get those <laughs> tickets pretty quickly if you want to go tomorrow night since considering they go so quickly thanks rochelle